And how do you lose as Watcher? Do this one. Pretty sure I'm on tilt now. <laughs> Playing Australia would be even worse for Telt. I mean, I don't know that for sure. Can I take a Rampage? With a Master of Strategy already? No one can stop me. Love this. Guess I shouldn't have played the other Defend. Team out on the watch. Rampage is a fun card. I mean, it's exact. Have to buy it. Pretty sure I already won because I got a Dark Embrace. Honestly, this might be my strongest Ironclad run start uh, in the last month. I think this is a good armaments upgrade. Do that next. Get out of my face! Taking immediate darker brace is just correct. Sour. Can intimidate with the Dark Embrace, I think. Reckless Charge, kind of interesting there too. This fight is already over. Way to take one. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Wait, maybe it was all part of my plan. If 
made a blood for blood cost two instead of one. How many heart kills do I get on average on the stream? Like per day? I don't know. Been playing two runs a day recently. It's fine to dig game on the farm. I'll work out some way to put it on play. I don't entirely have one yet, but you know. 37 health. It's never a gremlin knob. Hi, cat. Where are you going? Didn't think this through, did you? Almost strike. Decent card. Demon form is good in this fight. Actually, is it? No, I can't play Rampage. Oops. Most of my runs are wins. Chronic nosebleeds. Zipper the cat? Is that Zephyr's name now? Might be a better name for him. For as many jobs as cat. Oh, I didn't know. GG. Bag of prop. Bag of prop is excellent. Sword boomerang. Strength scaling attack with demon form. Power through is kind of a good card. I think my armaments plus is doing enough for it now. I have no idea. Not a single clue. Not a clue in the world. Wow, I like really don't know here. I think this is okay. Welcome, well, man. Glad you worked it out. There's stuff I want to play so I won't use the battle trance. This so blood for blood costs zero. I guess technically it costs one right now, but I'll take another damage and it'll go to zero. Is that what I said? Whatever. That can actually kind of clean in the. Fight! 
fire. I have so much card draw, and I have strength. Man. It's just not a runic pyramid. But I've taken Sneko here, too. I think. I don't know. I guess I have a couple of zeros. Three zeros. Uh, well, I guess I'm taking Coffee Dripper with Regal Pillow. That's kind of bad. Any house too real for this economy? Maybe if I had had time to get an inspection. Burning Pyramid was patched out last week. Oof. That explains it. You're on fire. I wish this was a heavy blade. I just don't actually have strength. I guess I bash first. Hey, Cuckoo for Coco Buff. Fire is just a pretty good card. I think Blood for Blood does what Anger does already. Probably. Also Rampage kind of does. Blood for Blood, Rampage, and Anger all kind of do a similar thing. Good heal. Someone say Dark Embrace is good. This deck would be good if I played Fiendfire. Fiendfire is a better Heavy Blade than Heavy Blade, and also a better Fiendfire than Heavy Blade. Probably true. Believable. Plus. Ever True Grip Plus? Flame Barrier. Ever Flame Barrier. Against El Campion. True Grip's pretty good here, actually. Sure. Simply Harvest Sneko's Eye after defeating it. I think we're just kind of busy. Just got places to be. There's a lot of the Spire to slay. Uh, 
Not a clue. <laughs> Just sitting here waiting for a, a line to seem obviously correct, but none of them are. Let's try this one. Where is Sentinel Plus? I mean, this one worked okay. I'm not complaining. Guess I could have played another Pommel Strike there. I had uh, done... Uh, a bit of due diligence and checked whether I had three or four energy right now. Turns out I have four. Every turn. Kind of broken. Doesn't that seem kind of broken? That's like a lot of energy. Uh take out for cut. But much rather just got a shockwave. And this stack. This stack feels like it is trying to go infinite. And uppercut's just kind of in the way. Man, lost blood for a blood. Too bad. Blood for blood's definitely a good card for me, too. Statements about Jorbs never taking damage have been significantly overstated. Exaggerated, whatever. You wish you had four energy a day, let alone a turn. Same. Me as well. Can't rest. Wow. Another energy sometimes? It's a lot of energy. Huh. Huh. Still have no idea. Still not a single clue in the world. Maybe battle trends. What's the difference between hot hand fallacy versus data driven decisions? Both assume the past will continue into the future. Is it simply the volume of data that's the difference? Uh, yes. Sounds right to me. Seems probably good. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't know what Hot Hammer Fallacy is. Thirty-three. Do you mean like when a basketball player has hit a bunch of shots in a row and so thinks that the next shot will also go in? Thirty-three. Sixty-nine. Pretty upsetting, but I don't actually have it here. Gotta get up and gotta get up. Oh. Get up and gotta get up. Hmm. I mean, that's just. That is successful BZ analysis, but you're placing too much value on recent events and not enough on your priors. Is what I would say about that. I think I wore one. Feel like being in the zone is a thing physically. People have looked at the data and it's not a thing physically. <laughs> I think we have data on this. But I'm not sure. Maybe I'm wrong. Hot hand fallacy. Basketball. Is it real? Usually when a player makes more shots than normal after making consecutive shots, they are likely to revert toward the shooting average by missing the next one. Hot hands they do exist, but they are rare. They do exist. There you go. They're rare. How do we feel about playing demon form here and then dying? Seems kind of better than the other options. To be honest. Taking three here is kind of good. By three, I mean 12, unfortunately. <laughs> Why does a pantograph heal you? I don't know. These are the questions not enough people are asking. All right, I beat Strength Book of Stabbing. I got a dual wield or a limit break. Dual wield blood for blood is kind of a common. You win the run kind of thing for Ironclad. I guess limit breaks also kind of a you win the run thing, but um, I think I'd rather have dual wield. It is a Chemex with Whirlwind. There's also a Horn Cleat. There's a second one. That's a pretty good second one. Very good second one, actually. Why does a coffee dripper prevent you from sleeping? I don't know. Just don't drink the coffee. 
Lol. I got deep breath and just kind of go infinite. Ish. Pretty good deep breath. I don't think I need Chemex because Warland doesn't do that much anymore. Lutterypno is going to take over. I definitely want a second one though. I think I'll just take a Horn Cleave. Expensive, but good. Mm. Our Ironclad Rare is good. Reaper is good. Corruption is good. Okay. Could have given away Coffee Dripper there if I desperately needed to rust. That would have been kind of epic. Oh, it's the noise of the coffee dripping? Gotcha. That makes more sense. That's a pretty good showing from Dual Wield, I thought. Doing well so far. Why did I even pick this up? Like, what's the point? I didn't even get a rare there? Hello? Hello. Hi. What's happening? I don't want this crap. How does a pair of these nuts get into your mouth? Hopefully with consumption. Scent is key here. I win? Oh. It'd be weird if I lost after doing that. You will win champion easy. Agree. But if I had more of these, seems like a good card here. Rose and shake, baby. Order? That order might have been wrong. Down a fiend fire? I guess so. I do have the best music here, it's true. I actually written and performed all of the music that I play in my channel to. I think that's why it's so good, because I really can relate to it on that level. Max, dual wield whirlwind would be kind of strong here though. Just quietly. We should use Rillwind. Rock the letter opener even with zero energy. A great idea.
What a great idea. I speak Sagandi is also unrelated, but how do we feel about D's nuts jokes in this stream? Honestly, BLS, if anyone successfully makes a joke, I'm just kind of happy. I've seen too many other comments. It is so painful discarding Whirlwind every turn after not buying Chemex. It's, it really hurts me to my core. Double tap. I guess Ironclad does have a lot of bad rares. Yeah, I guess Ironclad does have a lot of bad rares. I could take double tap and try to... I mean... I would rather just not. I'd rather just not. Alright. Uh, snack iron. It is a decent snack eye. It could be better. Maybe just the bell. I think just the bell. Don't hate it. I play Curse of the Bell here? I don't think so. The candle blood for blood is synergy, it's true. Dark Embrace as well. It's a pretty good blue candle. It's bizarre to me that I don't have a Gremlin one. Feels like I should have a gremlin. Dragon White draws three, Snacko draws two. It's just math. It is just math. I started singing the song and then realized that I didn't know any of the lyrics. Kind of a nightmare. <laughs> My favorite, Slay the Spire Flyer. 
Why would it be anyone other than me? Self-esteem issues? <laughs> I guess. You, like... An internet stranger you have never met, more or less than yourself. I like change. Is it twenty five months? Appreciate it. Maybe it's time to take uppercut. It's a bit better than it did the last time I was offered it. I have pocket watch now, so I want three card turns. I don't know if I can upgrade it. I might not be able to. I do kind of need to upgrade it for it to be good. Eh, let's just keep going for the infinite. Not sure you'd answer really any relevant metric with yourself if asked to that. Well. What does that say about you? Can I go abacus or feel no pain? I go abacus. This looks like a duck that might shuffle a bit. It would be kind of novel to find a seeing red. New Jorbs is where it's at. All your homies hate past Jorbs. Love that. to have many curses to get removal curses, you just have to have one plus a cinders man. Tangibly false claims in Twitch chat. another Dark Embrace. I'm kind of pleased with that. Second one seems good in this fight. Oh, hey. 
Fountain does not remove a Sunder's Bane, but it counts a Sunder's Bane when it's deciding whether or not it can spawn. Why don't you ever give me burns? Run. It's okay. Just give me the burns. Wait, I had another energy. It's like not the first time I've done that this run. Is this leaf on? Feels close. Is this 50? It's not. I think I might have been lethal. I feel like I might not have been counting the blood for blood getting played again. Noloth is helping. Do you think Seeing Rod is actually in the game? They might have removed Runic Pyramid and Seeing Rod and just not told me. It seems kind of plausible. Hey, Lydian Lights! Sundial's gone as well. I had Sundial last run. So I'm pretty sure that's not true. How do I take one more damage? Challenging. Red IRL is terrifying. I don't know if I've ever seen red in the IRL. What's going on in one's body when they see red IRL? I feel like Reckless Charge has to be good here, given that Dazed draws three cards. We'll just take it and work the rest out later, yeah. Removed seeing red and adrenaline yesterday. I would do it.
One? Wait, that's not a very big number. I'll just take five. I don't know. I don't know. Remember when Bloody encountered this elite for the first time with me? Honestly, I don't. What happened? Was it hilarious? Ooh, I was really excited for that one. I was like, ooh, maybe a Reaper? Maybe an Offering? Maybe Corruption? Maybe a Feed? Maybe a... Just any pickable card, really? You panic hard at the countdown, you're laughing uncontrollably. This sounds like me. I'm taking a Shrug Plus, just so I can play a Shrug Plus sometimes. Or it's okay. Damn. I mean, I would have made it better. I got a recall. So I can decide what the last upgrade is. At the final campfire. thought um letter up there would do something this run turns out I was wrong Is done 59 damage. Just needed a seeing at some point. Is that so much to ask? I don't know, maybe it is. Just as I was complaining, the thought that Letter Opener had abandoned me, it has returned to us. Fine. 
I would love to have a Juggernaut in my deck right now. That'd be great. Hi. Oh. I think it's Disarm. It sucks. just unreal that my energy never goes up as I play cards. Makes it very hard to have my energy go up when I play cards. The very thing that I would like to happen. Fires enough, I think. Didn't draw it. You play this sack, you would misplay every single turn and die almost immediately is why we have to rely on the professionals like me to play our children's video games. Can't be playing them ourselves. Trench? Hey, do you have an anchor and a horn plate? It's actually not unplayable. There's a wild strike with um second wind. I don't think it's real though. I think the thing I'm doing is just playing Reckless Charge second wind over and over again. I might take an Entrench Plus. It's a much stronger card, but this one is not an Entrench Plus. Watcher and I almost died to Transient. Let's see how this one goes. Should you be playing Whirlwind all the time now? They have Nunchaku since like a long time ago. I guess Jorbs kind of forgot about Nunchaku. I play as Pokemon. Does that mean what it sounds like it means? It sounds like the number pi is being used to input commands into a Pokemon game. That's incredible. What will they think of next? Did 
Didn't someone's goldfish beat Pokemon one time? Maybe with, like, help. I imagine the number pi is not receiving very much help, though. What is millennia? Very hard Elden Ring boss. Wait, really? Did it have like a broken build or something though? You think I could be that Elden Ring boss? I feel like it's unlikely. There was a goldfish Pokemon play that had to stop because it revealed the owner's credit card information on stream. You know, the future gets a lot of shit, but I'm glad we live in it. It is pretty funny sometimes. If you feel no pain, will you get dis desensitized to causing it? Uh, we're worried about the like ethical implications. That's a good thing to worry about. I couldn't say because in my own actual life I do still feel pain. That's very funny, right? Imagine getting doxxed by your goldfish. That is just really funny. <laughs> That's just one of the funniest things. I think the feel no pain to the deck feels quite relevant. The reckless charge that I'm trying to do everything with. I think so. Yeah, I think so. Alright, we got a barricade too. Anchor and Horncleat make it somewhat better. Maybe not a ton better. Yeah. Oh, well, thank you, HD. Armaments was the card I was looking for. Because now this week lasts until next turn. Which is good because next turn I am going to explode. Let's go feel my pain in fire. I don't really need this other stuff.
I think the fight's actually just over now. That is just a broken thing to be able to do. I may not have quite thought this out. Like, I don't think this infinite's an infinite. Well, I mean, okay, I never thought it was infinite, but... Work. I need another second one. Whoops. Not bad. Or I needed to play all three Dark Embraces, I guess. Gonna be okay though. The fish also bought a bunch of games from the Nintendo store. Understandable, in my opinion. There are some good games on there. I might do the same. If left to my own devices. I think Barricade carried the fight. But a few other things helped. If I played a second wind and then barricade, that would be kind of good. You know, it was a lot less good than I was expecting it to be. Weird. About this time... I felt kind of bad to be shooting the fish in Dave the Diver. I feel like I probably cared more about that than a fish would. I don't want to hurt the poor fish. They're so cute. Are we infinite with medkit? Aww. I assume so, somehow. Pretty weird if we weren't.
Now this right here is a Slay the Spire deck. That's more like it. How do we end up with a Rampage Plus? I think Rampage was the first card I took. After the Whale, I guess. Those are kind of the things I could take. I can also card remove. I can also Ari. I can also Art of War. Hmm. I don't have any energy. Maybe this gives energy. I found a Sentinel Plus. We take those here. I'm also taking Warcry. Alright. It's Lost Gift, work on Ari. Combat rewards, and Ari is not combat rewards, but I'm not sure. Not 100% sure. Wow. Huh. What do I do here? Dark Embrace? Dark Embrace is kind of defensible. I don't know if this was better than just Dark Embrace, Dark Embrace. I have nine block, but I only draw three cards. Oh wait, it was better. <laughs> oh boy. kind of wouldn't be good here. It is worse with a barricade in play. Arguably. Feeling really good about the choice to take a second wind.
Oh, hey, Norboro, how are you? One more attack. Ring for Shuriken or Sundial here. I think I need that. I don't think I need that. Who needs Shuriken when you have Rampage? It's probably good somehow. Maybe it's bad actually. Ah. Oh, also I already had that potion, so like, whatever. I want to be able to play Disarm, I guess. So I don't want to, like, draw a Void with one energy left at the same time as I draw Disarm. So maybe I don't play Evolve right now. How bad can this be? And okay. Oh, it seems excellent. Top deck barricade on both sword and spear. Sword and shield. Sword and spear? Is that both? Is it a spear and a shield? And the heart. Yeah, just lucky, I guess. Also make an infinite. I don't have any infinites here now. But I have a pretty big. That's enough. Any any of these? Kind of want to wield. Have a true grits? Thank you. 
Evolved at its best. Proud of it, honestly. Evolve did 22 damage. Wait, to me? Or. What? To the heart? Evolved it? Oh, with Fiend Fire? I understand. <laughs> I get it now. All right, GG. This is not an infinite. I lose energy. But it does. No. GG. I wrote a rant about dice on Twitter last night and the engagements that are fucking fucking incredible they're so funny oh people are so up in arms about dice <laughs>